Hey everyone, Jillian Ravel here with Iron Mag Labs, and I'm here today because I started an eight week trial of the Halo for Her Stack and the Asta RX. Um, I'd had a lot of girls, and actually a few men, contact me um, through the Iron Mag Labs forums and through Facebook um, and a few other forums asking me, um, does Halo for Her really work? you know, does it help build muscle, can you tell me a little bit about it? And I had used the product um, right before my shows uh, when I was, became an Iron Mag Lab sponsored athlete in March. Um, but I figured that, you know, what better way to show everyone the great effects that these products have than to do a trial myself. So uh, what you're about to see is a, my first two weeks of the, using the products um, in my off season. And you're going to see my first two weeks of my back and first two weeks of my leg days um, specific exercises while on these products. If you have any questions, hit me up on Facebook or the Iron Mag Lab forums. If you have any questions at all, comments, anything, I'll be sure to address it in the next video. All right, thanks guys. All right, Jillian, we are here and this is week back week number one and you are doing some dumbbell rows. Um, yep. How did you pick which exercise to do to test your strength? Um, well, I always love doing rows and I really thought that it's a key exercise for me in my off season. So I figured why not use dumbbell rows and you can really tell, you know, with your reps and, um, your form, if you're really making any progress. So that's why I cho chose the dumbbell rows. Yeah, you start with uh, 55s and then you go to 60s. I know you're doing a lot more sets in your back workout but we kind of decided to pick one exercise on each major body part to kind of compare uh, from week to week. Um, and uh, on this one, you're doing, the, as people are watching now, that you're doing the 60-pound dumbbells. Mm -hmm. um, you, uh, how did you feel like, you, this is your off-season. I know this is one of your very first off-seasons. What does that mean for you? Um, you know, there was a few things that I really wanted to do. For one, I wanted to grow my glutes. Um, that's always been something on me that's really small. <laughs> um, and I felt like I needed a little bit more overall muscle. Um, you know, looking at the winners of the shows and the girls that are placing top three in the shows after I uh, stopped my season, you know, they have a little bit more dense muscle than I had. So I figured I really needed to make some progress this season and add on as much muscle as I can. Oh. You know, even if I make like two pounds, I'd be happy. Well, uh, hopefully with Halo for her and Ostar X, you'll make more than that. Right now, we're watching you uh, uh, on week number two with the dumbbell rows. You're actually doing the 70-pound dumbbells, and i got to say, it looks like you're doing them easier um, than you did the uh, 60s the previous week. Yeah, actually, I had just, the first week, my first back day, I think I had been on the Halo for her for only about three days. And I had just come back from vacation. I was pretty beat up because <laughs> I took a really nice break. I didn't train for like two, three weeks. Mm -hmm. um, so the, my second week of training on the Halo for Her and Asta RX, I definitely felt stronger. Um, as you can probably see, my form is a lot better <laughs> uh, the second week than the first week too. So I really felt that it helped and you know, a 10-pound jump in a week is pretty good. <laughs> Absolutely. What, how much are you taking of the Halo for her at this point? Um, right now, I'm taking two a day. Um, one of the things that girls are always worried about, I hear, is side effects. Have you noticed any side effects from either the Asta RX or the Halo for her? You know, I haven't noticed any side effects. A lot of girls have been asking me, you know, is your hair growing or... Um, you know, are you unable to sleep? You know, I have crazy sleep anyway, so that's the, the same. Um, you know, I haven't noticed any uh, water gain or water retention at all. Right. Um, but I am using the complete stack, so I am using, um, you know, all the other products that go along with the stack. The, the but advanced cycle support and the uh, uh, e-control? Um, I'm actually using the razor cut. Oh, razor cuts. Um, the lean fuel. I gotta ask you. I gotta uh, stop you for a second. I'm watching you push on your knee here, and I, I, when I was watching this, I was wondering <laughs> what, what am I seeing here? You're pushing on your knee, your kneecap. Well, I wanted to show everyone um, because my knees are awful, uh -huh. and I have never been one to do free squats. I hate them because my knees slip out of the socket, and everyone always tells me, "Oh, wrap your knees," blah blah blah. 
No. My knees slip out of the socket, even if they're wrapped, and then they're being held out of um, the socket. So for me, the reason why I chose to squat, um, I wanted to show that my strength um, has gone up and that even with my really bad knees, I have been able to make progress in my squatting. Yeah, and uh, on your first uh, day, you did 12 reps with 185. We're now watching yeah. your second week, um, and you do 185, and you get a, a very respectable 14 reps. Um, yeah. Now, why did you decide to move up again? You went to a 225 after that. Was that originally the plan, or you just decided you felt good? Why not? No, I felt really good that day, and, you know, Going back, I never used to squat, and if I did squat, I would use a 25 on each side. So I was just so excited that I got 135 <laughs> the first week, um, so, and then 175. So I was like, you know what? I'm pushing it because, you know, I trust uh, my boyfriend as a spotter, and I think that's also really important to have someone behind you that you really trust. And I just wanted to show, you know, in like two weeks, I went from – really never squatting all the way to 225. Well, that's a good stopping point for the video. We'll be back in two weeks to show some other lifts. Thank you.